would you like to talk about? Hi. Okay, we'd like to talk about your film, Irene in Time. Irene in Time. Your what? film coming out. Oh yeah, Irene in Time. <laughs> I forgot about that. One. I'm in it. You are. You the, directed you, it. Oh right, and you're the girl who uh, yeah. goes through the whole. The thing She's with fantastic. the dads. Yeah. So <laughs> she, oh, the thing with the dads. Yes. Irene in Time is a movie about fathers and daughters, and uh, the effect that the relationships uh, between fathers and daughters, uh, the incredibly complicated and intense relationships that take place in the lives of men and their daughters, affects those those girls when they become women and uh, in terms of their relationship to the men in their lives later on in their life. So um, um, Tana Frederick is the star, a spectacular star, um, who, who, whose story this really is. So I don't know what we're It's kind of your time. story because you have a beautiful daughter and your father. Yeah, but I don't, I'm not going to go into all that. No, so, I didn't ask you to go into all that, I just was commenting. Yeah. So, um, uh, you have to ask me a question. Okay. Now, Rainbow Pictures. Rainbow okay. Pictures is my company. Okay. And how did you start it? What was the idea behind it? The idea behind it was to make movies. Um, I wanted to make movies, and um, you need a company to make movies. So I created a company called Rainbow, the Rainbow Film Company, and we we produce. I direct, she stars lately, um, and we distribute frequently our own films. You know, uh, how, about, how many films, roughly, have, have you made since you've been open? Sixteen. No, sixteen that I've, films that I've written and directed, but uh, Rainbow is about eight or nine, I don't know exactly. Oh, that's amazing. We also distribute other people's films. We, we distribute the Monty Python films throughout the United States, and Hearts and Minds, and we pick up films. Max Schell made a wonderful documentary about his sister Maria, so we, we distributed that. But uh, we and we distributed my films. Now, um, now you now you worked with Tana. The first one was Hollywood Dreams. But how did you meet Tana, and how did you start working together? Oh, I have no energy to tell that. Tana, how did we meet? Um, she wrote me a letter. She, yeah. she manipulated me, completely <laughs> hustled me. Um, I got a letter one day from this person. For me, saying that I loved his films. Yeah, but I didn't know who the person was, and she just did this incredibly smart, articulate, funny letter about how wonderful one of my movies was. And what I didn't, and I called her in because she was so intelligent. She had such good taste, obviously, as to like my movies. And um, somebody had told, well, somebody told me that if you write Henry a, a letter that about how much you love his films, that he would cast you and in his films. But what she didn't tell me until three years later was that she never actually saw the film she wrote me about. That she in fact just saw the opening credits and then made this whole thing up. So she totally hustled me, knowing from her friend that I'm a sucker for, for a letter about how wonderful one of my movies is and that would get her going and get her into this whole thing and uh, I've been stuck with her ever since. Yeah. And I've seen all your films a lot and done three and plays with you. And done three plays and a fourth coming up this fall. Yep. Yeah. And since I since I ran in time, we have shot Queen of the Lot. Queen of the Lot, which will be out next year. But we should be talking about Irene in time because that's coming out this summer.